and cover her well. Fair catch made at the 25-yard line. The Panthers take over first and 10 at their own 25-yard line. The Panthers out there and ready to begin their next drive. And they're hoping to redo their efforts of the last drive when they got into the end zone. And just think of what it's like now on the sideline. Because when you score a touchdown, you have to go over and look at the tablet and see what you did on the last drive. When you score points, it's a whole lot better view than when you're trying to figure out how to fix things there. Brings up second and escaping the pressure right. And he will find the open man. It's DJ Moore. And he'll get it out near the 40 to the 39. That one, a first down pickup of eight. First and 10 at the 39-yard line. Now Murray. And he was hit as he threw it there, and it forces it incomplete. A couple extra defensive backs out there in the dime, and because of that, really not many places to throw the football, if any. And typically, what would you want to do against that dime? Run the football. You want to run the ball, but you can't do it in this situation. Not nearly enough time on the clock. You have to really navigate against a tough defense presented against you. That's to McCaffrey complete. And he's going to be out of bounds right at midfield. 11 yards there, first down. That's what they need right now. Get the first down, get out of bounds, stop the clock. Just playing smart football, understanding the situation, making the plays necessary, and making sure that clock stops at every opportunity. He'll get this to McCaffrey out of the backfield. And he'll go down inside the 45 before going out of bounds. Give him six on the play, and that'll make this a second down. Brings up second and four. Now a run with McCaffrey. And he is met quickly in the backfield. Down he goes, folded like a lawn chair. Call that a loss of a yard, and things get a little more difficult here. Third and five. And it looks like we've got a dime set here defensively. Six DBs in the game. Back to throw, Murray. And he finds a man, it's McCaffrey. The 20, and down he goes, taking it inside the 10, just shy of the five at the six. Now the Panthers gonna use the first of their timeouts as they'll stop the clock with 24 seconds to go in the game. Now a chance to make that big play really hurt. It's first and goal just outside the five. The Packers gonna use one of their timeouts. It's just their first. They've got two more to use here in the final stages. time left so you can't count your chickens before they're hatched. Well, they better come back in here and watch this one because you and I, we're not going anywhere. We want to see this one play out. And that will make this a four-point game. Makes the score Panthers 28, Panthers 24. Now after the touchdown, here's Bunker on to kick it away. Takes it at the seven. And he'll be out of bounds across the 25. First and 10 at their own 27 yard line. Oh, yeah! The Packer offense ready to get their next drive underway. They have a little bit of time left here, but this one not going to go their way. And this is where, in this situation for me, you just go ahead and run out the clock, shake hands, congratulations, yeah, and move on. Because now, you're not going to make up for what's happened during the game in this last sequence. We'll see what they do here in this last sequence. Second and 10 now from the 27. Now Edwards aware. He'll have a first down past the 40. And he's going to get this to the 40-yard line. 
Now they do indeed get the timeout, so all is not lost. They'll have a chance for one final heave to the end zone. Packers. One last shot for Mayfield here. Flush to his right. Now a desperation throw. Deep depth. He's got it. Hit the 15. And he's finally taken down. But not before he reaches the 14. And what a ride it has been. NFC champs, they have punched their ticket to the biggest show in sports. And what a way to get there. To go the entire season and then play for the right to go to the Super Bowl and the right